Prince Harry Heartbreak, the surprising future that lies ahead for Harry and Meghan in L.A. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have been carrying out engagements throughout the coronavirus pandemic thanks to virtual platforms, allowing them to work on causes close to their hearts. However, while footage of the discussion showed Meghan looking comfortable and happy, the Duke of Sussex looked lost in his own thoughts as an unclear fate appears to lie ahead for him. Royal commentator Richard Fitzwilliams has spoken to Express.co.uk about the future of the couple. Of the Duchess, Mr. Fitzwilliam said, There is no doubt that this is very much her territory and this is where she feels happy. This is her home and also where her voiceovers, speaking and engagements are. She has shown that she is particularly adept to that. She is very articulate and she is an activist. Her last engagement, speaking at the Girl Up Leadership Summit, was very much something a Democratic Party politician could have done. He added, I think she is in the home turf. She is very happy because they also have Archie. However, when it comes to the Duke, life in Los Angeles may not be as straightforward. When negotiating his departure from the royal family, Prince Harry had to give up some of the titles and work that he was most proud of, particularly in the military. Mr. Fitzwilliam said, but so far as he is concerned, there is a question mark over what he has left behind. The removal of his military titles that was very hurtful. I think particularly the title of Captain General of the Marines because that was his grandfather's. Also they made it absolutely clear that they are unhappy with the settlement with the Queen which is reviewed at the end of March next year. Issues such as using Sussex Royal or the fact that they wanted to be part-time royals. There is no question Harry fell head over heels in love with Meghan but I think there is also no doubt that this is leading him to an area in his life that he thought he would never be in. The Queen is 94 and Prince Philip is 99 and because of the pandemic he will not see them for some time and it is unclear what the future holds for him. The royal couple moved to Los Angeles following a tumultuous few months that saw them step back from their senior royal roles and make a temporary move to Canada. The sudden onset of a global pandemic meant that the pair had to restructure the way they worked in order to fulfill new necessities. Mr. Fitzwilliam said, Harry is in this strange situation and he is in L.A. How they would be able to operate, especially given the problems with the virus in America, is completely unclear. They are in someone else's home in Hollywood, without a specific role while the royals here have managed to create roles using virtual links.